Was there a point this season when you had given up hope and you didn't think you were going to win? You know, the hope never was... I, I wouldn't say I gave up hope, but I accepted losing. When was that? That was today. Today I was like, okay... That was like the first time that happened for you? Whatever happens, you know, um... Yeah, that was probably the first time that I said to myself, you know what, I'm good. Wherever wherever it falls, America has done it. It's not producers, it's not coaches. You know, I left my heart on the stage yesterday. Whatever happens, happens. And I'm just going to go out here and have a good time with my boys. We're going to go out and, 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 and jam it on the one. What did Blake <laughs> say to you after your name was called? I, mean, I told you, mean, buddy. Yeah. I told you, buddy. Oh man, him Blake Happy is like Santa Claus, <laughs> the Easter Bunny, and uh, and Ronald McDonald in one. It's like I told you, buddy. It was like it was, like, it was crazy. Um, he was so proud. Yeah, he was so proud. He was so happy, man. And you know, he does this. You know, Blake is a he's a good he's a good guy, man. He's like a country boy, you know. And mm -hmm. and I respect him, and I get him, I get him, I understand him. He's uh he's like my friends back home. He's like he's he reminds me a lot of myself. Um, believe it or not, you know um, yeah we're different genres and from different places. But he's a man, you know and 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 you know the fact that he kept me around. That's all I really asked of him to do. And 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 he said the rest is up to you. And you know I feel like I've done my job for him. And and he's definitely done his job for me. What what did this experience teach you about the sort of performer that you want to be? The sort of music you want to do? This this whole experience is um it's kind of sharpened my blade you know even Blake being my coach his questions and, and his song uh ideas he's like maybe, maybe you should do this Jermaine and, and what, what his question and, and, and his uh his song ideas did for me it was just help me kind of focus on what I really wanted to get across to to the world and to America what I really want to say I mean, it's okay to get up and, and, and sing and dance and, and have a good time, but what are you really trying to get across to, to the listener? And, and um, it really helped me choose my songs. And, you know, I think, you know, from moving forward, what America can expect from me is, is those type of songs. The songs that are going to speak to speak to people's hearts and speak to their emotions. I feel like there's a, there's a it's missing in the world right now. Um, you know, and people call them rock songs or pop songs, but I just call them good songs, you know, where the lyrics are just really speaking to you, and everybody's going through an open arms, everybody's going through against all odds, everybody's going through a, a living on the prayer, everybody, yeah. every race, religion, style of music, we all been through it, and everybody's felt like they they want to fly. Did you, did you say you had already heard from Alicia, did she call you already, what was that phone conversation, and when did that happen? She called me on stage. <laughs> yeah. you, you don't send this piece of voicemail, you're like, hello? <laughs> my best friend, my best friend is uh, her manager, it's like a personal manager, okay. and uh, he came out here to, to support me. Uh, tonight? Yeah, tonight. My best friend DJ Walton, he's been with me every step of the way and watching, helping me throughout this journey uh, with The Voice and before The Voice. So he was here and, you know, of course, you know, she called his phone like, you know, oh, damn, <laughs> grab the cheek. <laughs> I owe you. <laughs> Gonna get you. <laughs> she called his phone. And yeah, yeah, yeah. She called. She yeah, yeah. She called. That, yeah. Uh, either he called her. Or she. I don't know yeah. how it worked, but um, definitely. Um, yeah. She. You know. I spoke to her, and um, yeah, she was screaming like the top of her lungs, and <laughs> what just she made say? me feel like a million bucks, man. She's so proud of me. Yeah. Her and Mama Keys was, uh, you know, right there, and watching they, it together. Yeah, they yeah. were right watch, watching on the yes. couch, and they were, you know, excited for me. And, and she just, it's, she just expressed how happy she was for me, and you know, no, no, no better feeling than that. Yeah. How will you celebrate? Uh, yeah, um, uh, yeah, celebrating. Yeah, <laughs> yeah.